our galaxy. Well, it's interesting though, that if you ask astronomers, so you say, what's the probability of other civilizations being out there? Then they will point, for example, to the new data from the Kepler Space Telescope, which tells us that there are probably around 20 billion Earth-like planets in the Milky Way galaxy, in the sense that they're small rocky planets in what's called a habitable zone around stars. The Goldilocks. Around main sequence stars like the Earth, <laughs> uh, like the Sun. So, so 20 billion, so maybe one in 10 stars uh, in the sky has uh, an Earth-like planet around it, potentially. So that's a lot. So you think 20 billion? Well, surely life must have arisen on, on some of those. The answer is probably yes, I suspect. I suspect we'll, we'll, we may find life on Mars in the next 10 years, but it'll be microbes. So the question then becomes, well, how likely is it for simple life, if it arises, to make its way into a civilization? And that's where the biologists come and, and kind of calm the astronomers down and say, well, you might think there are lots of places for life, we would agree. But on Earth, it took 3.8 billion years to go from the origin of life to a civilization, which is about a third of the age of the universe, give or take.